is Diego from Nutri Admin, and this is a demonstration of how you can download a meal plan and send it over email to a client using an Android phone. This will also work for Android tablets. So the first thing you want to do is to click on the PDF tab in the meal plan. Then you can select the parts of the meal plan you want to include in the PDF. And then you need to click on download PDF. And what should happen is that you should get a dialog like the one I have in here. Do you want to download this uh, document? And then you can click on download. And once it's downloaded, you can click on this open button. Uh, I'm going to open this document with Google Drive, which is a free application. You can download it from the uh, from the Google Play Store. And as you can see, I have the I have the PDF here. So now, uh, how to send it to a client? So to do this, you can click on these three dots on the top, and this may uh, change slightly depending on your Android version on your phone, but it should be a similar process. Uh, and here I have this option send file, and when I click in here. Google is opening, uh, showing me contacts and all the apps that I can use to uh, work with this PDF. So uh, you can use uh, Dropbox, you can use WhatsApp, Skype, um, probably most often you will want to use something like Gmail. And when you click in here, this will open a compose window in Gmail. And as you can notice, um, there is the PDF file already attached to the document. So now you can type your contact, a uh, subject, you can say uh, something like, um, hello, John, here is your meal plan. And your contact will be able to open the meal plan in their email because it's going to be sent as a normal attachment as if you send it from a computer. So uh, that's all. The process is uh, relatively simple. Um, just a couple of things to take into account is if you're doing this for the first time, you may have to uh, confirm uh, in a dialog box. Uh, the phone may ask you, do you want to allow NutriAdmin to uh, open pop-up windows? And you need to say yes. And also... Um, you may have to do this over Wi-Fi or um, you may have to go to the settings and allow uh, the browser to download documents over uh, mobile data. But uh, it's recommended you do it over Wi-Fi so that um, you can download all the data without consuming your uh, mobile data if you have some limits. So that's all. If you have more questions, any questions, you can contact us at Support and Admin. And there is also some tips and uh, advice on how to download file some mobile devices in our uh, doc section. Thanks for watching and uh, have a nice day.